All right, welcome back, YouTube. Uh, we have a funny video today, actually. It's actually kind of serious and kind of funny. I have Twitch chat here with me that kind of helped me with this build. This is actually going to be hilarious. I can't even do this without laughing. We don't need a friend unit here. This is going to be a test for a build for uh, the new CG Citra. <laughs> um, so what we did, um, so we immediately put Carbuncle on her for the one limit break stone per turn. Um, she, it'll, be, it'll be optimal for my build. I don't since I don't have enough limit break stones per turn. She needs to stay at a five star uh, base right now. She can't be six star. She has to be five star, so her limit break only costs um eight, eighteen limit break stones. Yeah, at five, er, so you would need at least nine per turn, nine limit break stones per turn for her limit break at five. So I need to leave her at five star. For six star, you're gonna need twelve limit break stones per turn. Um. Hello YouTube. So what I did for this build, I give her Bowie Knife, uh, which has high tide on it, which increases her limit break fill gauge rate. We give her Prodigy Goggles, which gives her two limit break stones per turn. We give her in uh, CG Lids TMR, which um, gives her also gives her two limit break stones per turn. So we have four limit break stones per turn right now, plus Carbuncle is one limit break stone per turn. Then we have Bomb Spirit, which you can get from the um, uh, Bomb Trial. This is, uh, now we're up to seven limit break stones per turn. Then we have Protector of Lapis, which is two more. So that's nine limit break stones per turn. So that's enough to fill her limit break gauge like every two turns. And then we just filled the rest with Mood Maker because I don't have any more um, limit break stone gear, at least. Hey, hey, Red, what's up? Shadow, Shadow. Yeah, we give her Mood Maker and um, then we give her some Evo Magic. I'm just give her Frozen Crown, Holy One, Imminent Everbuster. Acknowledge me. I'm acknowledging you, Red. Praise the sun. We got this. Red helped build. Red helped build my Citra. He was suggesting. Um, he was suggesting lots and lots of um, whale items that I did not have. So this would work best if you had a Nirvana, or you could do Vault Keys to equip the Algean Arm. Um, there, there are some better gear options, but. Unfortunately, I do not have those options. So, uh, then we brought Lid, uh, Fina, Orlando for the, um, we brought Orlando so we can light in peril. We bought Ramza for the Entrust. We bought Lid for her Entrust. And we brought Fina to use Shining Cheer. So, this is my Citra build, guys, and we're just gonna go in and show you how this build works. Alright, so, if everything works well, it should be fine. Rip red, we're fine. Time out of the sun, rip. <laughs> hey, Serapy, welcome back to the stream. So first thing we're going to do with Fina is we're going to use Shining Cheer here. Great. Um, we're going to make Orlando auto attack. He's going to auto attack one unit to build some limit break gauge for everybody. And then we're going to use Lids and Truss on Citra. We're going to use Ramses and Truss on Citra. We're going to use both of these and Trusses. And then we're just going to defend with Citra, actually. Alright, so she should get enough limit break stones here from the auto to fill her limit break gauge up. Great. So then this turn, you can um, just use a limit break. So with this team comp, you should be able to use a limit break every second turn. And her limit break, um, if you have more limit break gear, you can uh, evolve her to six star or seven star, whatever you need. But um, yeah, so that's the build. So then, um, maybe we could just click after the limit break ends on the next turn. I'll just show you how the next turn would work. Usually, you're probably going to kill with a limit break. It's a pretty hefty... It's pretty hefty. It is being recorded, Red. Um, it's a pretty hefty limit break. So, then you can just reload Shining Cheer with Fina and then reload Ramza. We can auto-attack with Orlando again. This is going to be like the turn rotation. If you had her 6-star, you would have more options available. But unfortunately, we don't. So we're just going to entrust with Ramza and trust with Lid. We're going to defend with Citra again. Great. So you, as you can see, you can easily build her limit break. So she, she can limit break again here. And you can just spam her limit break all day, right? So yeah, that's the Citra build, guys. Obviously, if you wailed a little bit and you have some more, uh, you can get some more limit break gear and you can make her at six there. But yeah. Make sure you put the title featuring Solaris Knight. We'll do that, Red. I'll do that for you. So yeah, that's the build, guys. Um, you can have fun with it. Orlando can do more things if the enemies were stronger. Like, he could probably Divine Renation and stuff. 
But yeah, if the more limit break gear, the better. So I'll just end the battle here. We can do Shining Cheer, Auto, Auto Attack, what land do. And we can just entrust uh, Citra again a little bit. <laughs> Wait, what? Um, anyway, yeah. So how many waves? This is only three out of four. I'm actually going to stop here after this one. We could just, I'm just showing you that we could build our limit break super fast. So you can just spam our limit break all day. As much as you want. And uh, yeah, so that's how you build CG Citra. You want to build her for limit break? Lim as much limit break gear as possible. We'll just review here again. Uh, this is, this is a much, as much as I had. We have Bowie Knife with High Tide. Prodigy Goggles, which is free from a raid event a while ago. Um, I want to build her as a tank? No, you have to build her limit break. Um, so, Invendigrator, I can't pronounce this, but it is Lids TMR. Um, bomb Spirit, which is from the bomb, bomb Family Bomb Trial. Protector of Lapis, uh, fills the limit break gauge, that is Reigns TMR. Moodmaker is Promptness TMR, and then you can just put, throw some damage on her. And make sure you ha give her Carbuncle as well. So yeah, that's the video, guys. I hope you have fun. Um, yeah. Hope that it helps. Alright, thanks guys. Bye. Bye YouTube. Thanks for subbing.